Hi guys, this is Haunted School on Nostalgitronics UK, and in today's video, I'm going to be doing a restoration on this cool catfish. Um, this is the second one in our collection, and um, cool thing about this one, um, this one is one that um, has the phrase "port the other white meat," whereas the one I've got does not have that phrase. Um, so, um, in my opinion, this could. This version is the most common version, one that does not see it, and um, it's a lot rarer in the UK to get one that does see it, which is kind of weird, because I know all the ones in the US have that phrase. Um, but yeah, this practically does nothing at the moment. Button is pretty much screwed. Um, plaque's in nice condition, in better condition than mine, in fact. Um, on the back, that's what it looks like. So here's a demo of how it works currently. Whistle piece is broken, that's for sure. Something smells fishy around here. You can tune a piano, but you can't tune a fish. <laughs> Something's definitely broken in that tail What's as well. What's the matter? You've never seen a talking fish before? Yeah, there you go, you pretty much get the idea. Um, but yeah, I'm going to take this apart and uh, 3D print a new whistle piece for him, um, which I'll probably show you the process on that. And we'll go from there. Okay, so we've taken the whistle piece out. Um, I found the reason that behind why the tail wasn't working properly is actually the, the broken parts of the whistle piece were getting in contact with the in contact with the gears causing the tail to click so that that's that problem resolved and um, but now um, we're going to um, 3d print a whistle piece for this because it is very broken as you can see right here that's the remains of it and uh, there's the, the head paddle gear which is all fine it's meant to be like rounded but like that because for whistle piece what it does i've explained a couple of times before it just pushes into that tab and makes the head move up so i'm gonna um get one 3d printed right now and put it put it in him and see how it goes <laughs> Okay, so the new whistle piece uh, is um, all been made, as you can see right there, yep, new whistle piece is on, and um, what you're going to do is put it down there like so, and see this gear, the head gear, just place that, um, ensuring that um, basically the whistle piece is behind it. So I'm going to just demonstrate how this will work. See the shaft will turn and in fact I've got actually this piece will move and push the whistle piece. So you see why um, the whistle piece fish actually, you can move the head manually and you can't hear the motor sound. That's because that's because this this gear is the thing that catches onto the motor. So um, that's um, your explanation for how that works. So I'm going to put this back together and um, give you a demo of it fully working. Just before I actually put this together, always make sure with these mechanisms to um, to make sure this middle gear is in the middle. Otherwise, if it's that way, it won't catch on to anything and um, yeah, nothing will work. So as you can see, this side, you can see, pushes the tail and um, this side, uh, it's already caught onto this now. We'll push the head like that, as you can see. So guys, here is the finished result on Cool Catfish. 3D printed uh, whistle piece is now installed. It's all back together. Um, I had to put speaker wire back on because that unfortunately came off whilst um, fixing this. But yeah, he's in great condition. Um, not a problem with him. And uh, it's very cheap as well. I got him, we got him for about 10 99 which was really good. So, without any further ado, here we go. Excuse me, I must have eaten a bad worm. Don't look at me that way! 
way. Something smells fishy around here. You can tune a piano, but you can't tune a fish. What's the matter? You've never seen a talking fish before? So yeah, that's about all these phrases. Um, it's a really cool version. Um, as I said, this is the US version that, that, that says pork the other white meat, which I know the UK ones uh, don't have that phrase for whatever reason. <laughs> but yeah, there you go. So thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you all in the next video.